And hey, this is Francisco. I'm one to share off your phone. And if you've ever locked yourself out of your iPhone in the past by accident, uh, you might actually find yourself in a pretty tough spot if you come across an emergency where you need to use your phone right away. And it can even happen under a variety of circumstances, like things as silly as if you just like change your password frequently and you may just forget uh, the new one and lock yourself out, or something a little bit more, more lightly toned, like you're supposed to change your password without telling you, or your kid or little sibling accidentally locked you out, and much more. My point with all of this is that it's perfectly normal for any of, of these things to actually happen, and I am going to be right here to offer a solution to you. And this solution will work for just about any iPhone release within the last few years, such as the iPhone SE, 11, 10R, now the 7 Plus, the 6S Plus, the 6, and the 5S, and so on. So let us go ahead and begin. We've actually got two methods of getting this done. And for method number one, we're going to be using our own Dr. Phone software to unlock your phone if you've locked yourself out. And before anything though, please make sure that you are actually on iOS 13 or below, otherwise it may not work. The first thing that you need to do is just go ahead and download the Dr. Phone software. And you're going to find the links to that in the description. And then once you've downloaded it, just go ahead and launch it and click on screen unlock from the main menu. And then plug in your phone onto your computer to establish a secure connection between the two. And once a Dr. Phone detects your iPhone, it is going to show you the options for unlocking your phone. And then go ahead and click on unlock iOS screen to get to work. In the new window, it might just ask you to put your phone into DFU mode. So follow these steps if it does ask you to do so. But if it doesn't, then you're pretty much good to go anyway. So we can actually move on to the next step. And from here, I should be able to see your device model and iOS version. And just make sure that this information is indeed accurate and then click on start in order to begin. And once the firmware gets downloaded, the Dr. Phone software will proceed to delete your password and just click on unlock now and then confirm that this is exactly what you want as it is going to erase your, your entire phone data along the way. So this is a very important decision to make. You need to know for sure if this is how you want to go about it. And within a few minutes, you should be good to go as your iPhone will, will restart, fully reset, and it's going to be as if you had a brand new device. However, it is going to be free of a lock screen, which is our goal to begin with. Our second method will be through Find My iPhone. And this is going to be another great way of getting rid of that pesky lock screen. So do allow me to walk you through these steps. In your computer, I just go to iCloud's official website and then log in. And once you're in, go ahead and click on all devices. And if your iPhone had it, Find My iPhone on the entire time, and then it should appear on the list right underneath that. And then go ahead and click on your phone and then select Erase iPhone. And then all of your data is going to be erased from it, including that pesky lock screen. And now your iPhone is going to reboot as if it were brand new and you're pretty much good to go from here and you should be all set. And that's pretty much it. Which method was your favorite? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And also don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss any uploads and make sure to leave a comment if you found this video helpful. And now, until next time, have a good one and enjoy.